Hi everyone, it's Thursday the 26th of May and yesterday was chemo number 10. I uh, just got two more to do out of this round and it's done. Uh, and side effects wise, doing great, can't complain at all. Still got the rash on my face, but it's not bad. Keeping hold of my hair just about, it's thinning, but you probably can't really notice I can. Uh, taste buds have come back, so that's good. So yeah, it's uh, nothing to complain about. Probably the hardest thing uh, at the moment is chemo brain. Um, so apparently like pregnancy brain, baby brain, but I don't really remember having that with Luke, but I'm doing some really silly things. So um, this weekend, uh, completely cocked up plans with Tim and Gemma for going out for, for lunch massively, uh, which meant that it cocked up loads of other plans that we said no to because we thought we were going out with Tim and Gemma. Um, and the best one was that Luke got a new bank card um, sent to him in the post a few weeks ago. So um, I sent him a photo of it so he could attach it to his Apple Pay. So he had means of paying for things. And then I needed to post his card to him, which I did. Um, but I sent him mine. Um, don't know why I did that. So now I don't have a card. So Luke uh, sent me a photo of my card back. Um, so that I at least had my details if I needed them. And then last week I attached my card to uh, an app that I used to buy gift vouchers to uh, buy things with. Um, anyway, I didn't attach my card to that. I attached his card to it. So it turns out I've been shopping courtesy of Luke. I've only realised tonight and I texted him and said, have I been using your bank card? And he was actually on the phone to the bank, querying the transactions and was seconds away from cancelling the card because he thought that he'd had it cloned. Um, so uh, disaster averted and uh, he, he's not cancelled his card and I owed him £108 that I'd spent without him knowing. <laughs> So that makes a change that I owe him money mark rather than the other way around. So yeah, I'm quite I'm quite dangerous when it comes to arranging anything. So if if we're planning any social plans, I need to to um, not get involved, and you just need to do it with John because I'll just get it wrong. Um, but yeah, other than that, everything's great. Um, we're going to Durham this weekend. Um, looking forward to that. It's our first trip away since uh, since the diagnosis. So uh, um, we like to get away. So if anybody's got any recommendations for anywhere in Durham, do let me have them. Um, and then next week, uh, we're going away to see Luke, which will be the first time we've seen him since Mother's Day. Uh, and we, can, <laughs> we can swap bank cards. Um, so yeah, I've got a few things to look forward to. Then by the time we've done that, then uh, Greece is around the corner. Really, really looking forward to that. Um, and uh, yeah, nothing else to report. Thank you for all your messages still. I really do like hearing from you all. So uh, keep them coming and uh, we'll, uh, we'll keep you posted with developments. Lots of love and see you soon. Thank you.